In this video, we're gonna be unboxing and reviewing the Trio Max from Mobile Pixels. Let's get right into it and open it up. When you open the box, the first thing you're gonna see is this little setup guide, which you definitely have to read. The way this works is that the portable monitor will be attached to the back of your laptop with these magnets and uh, they're adhesive, so you can take them out if you want, but that makes it so that you can easily snap on and off the monitor. And as you can see right here, here's your little template and there's your monitor. Let's go ahead and switch the angle. And here's a closer look at the template and the setup guide. And finally, here is the Trio Max. Right away, I'm impressed with how it feels, how it looks. And on the left-hand side, you can see two USB-C ports. If you're connecting to your PC or your Mac, then you only need to use one cable. But if you're gonna connect this monitor to a smartphone or a Nintendo Switch, then you're probably gonna need to use the second port to power it up. But that shouldn't be a problem because you can easily connect it to a portable battery. It's worth noting that this monitor is called the Trio Max because you can connect another monitor on top of this. So inside the package, there's only one monitor, but you can buy another Trio Max monitor and you can easily attach it so you can have a triple monitor setup. And that's pretty amazing, but I can't show that in this video because I only have one monitor. But either way, let's get right into the setup. Now let's go ahead and attach the monitor to my laptop. Make sure you remove any dust. So the Trio Max comes in different sizes for different laptops. And this product was given to me so I didn't get to pick the size of the monitor. While I was doing this video I realized this monitor doesn't really fit my laptop. This is a gaming laptop and it's 16 inches and it's a little bit different than a normal laptop. So it doesn't really fit on this one perfectly but I'm still gonna try. I also have a second laptop. This one is 13 inches but the Trio Max is way too big for this laptop as you can see right here. Trio Max completely covers the laptop so I can't use that laptop either. Okay, so despite the fact that this monitor is not going to fit perfectly, I'm still going to try. So I'm going to go ahead and put the magnets on. Then you can go ahead and put the monitor right on top of the laptop and it will snap into place. Okay, so I managed to install the Trio Max on my gaming laptop and it is not perfect. It's not really supposed to look like this, but I figured let me try at least. This monitor would normally be more down, but it can't because my laptop is blocking it. If you get this monitor, you will not have this problem because this laptop is weird. But anyway, you get the idea of how it works. I can still slide out the monitor and I can go ahead and turn the monitor and I can go ahead and plug it up right here, my USB cable. And as you can see, now the backlight is on. That means that the monitor is working and I can see it right here. So now I got a portable dual display. But one of my favorite features of the mobile Pixel monitors is that you can also use it in portrait mode. And having a second monitor in portrait mode is really handy. So I can go ahead and snap the monitor right off my laptop and I can flip it in portrait mode. And as you can see right here, it is great for browsing your social media feed like Instagram or TikTok, answering emails, or just reading news articles. Some websites, some applications, they just look better in portrait mode. Over here, we got the Duex Plus. And over here, we got the Trio Max. And at first, I didn't realize how big the Trio Max was compared to the Duex Plus. So this is more for 13 inch laptops. It's thinner, it's lightweight, and I think I said it before, it feels a little bit fragile, but again, this is great for traveling and for smaller laptops. Also, it has a little backlit light when it's connected to your PC. Also on the back, it has a really nice 3D texture to it. This one is more just basic and smooth. They're both great, but the Trio Max just feels so much better. Also, another difference, the Duo X Plus has the menu control buttons on the back of the monitor. And the Trio Max has the menu buttons kind of hidden on the side. I don't know if you can see it right there. This is to control the brightness and the menu button. So just for fun, I connected both the Durex Plus and the Trio Max to my laptop. Never mind the cables. Obviously, I would not recommend having two displays like this. This is just for a test. So they both look the same. Obviously, the Trio Max is bigger than the Durex Plus. But in terms of the display quality, I think they both look the same. Okay, now we are back to having the Trio Max attached to my laptop. And as you can see right here, I can adjust it. I can move it forward and backwards. And I almost forgot to mention that this monitor is a 1080p display and it looks great. And as I said before, you can control the brightness by clicking on the panel on the side right there. You can see the menu options to control the brightness, the contrast, the saturation, and you got eye care mode. Let's go ahead and turn that on. So far, I've been using it for the past few days and I had no issues with it. So I highly recommend it. I think it's worth it for gaming, for productivity, and for people who want to get more out of their laptop. So if you are interested in this product, I will have a link in the description below. And if you have any questions, you can leave it in the comments below or reach out to me on Instagram at ernesto.tech.